How's it going, my fellow homo sapiens? It's your boy, Uzi Makado, and this is a Ghost in the Shell teaser trailer review. This and more coming at you next. So what I want to do with this teaser trailer is talk about things I like and things that I dislike about the teaser trailer altogether. Now when I heard it was coming out with a Ghost in the Shell movie, yes, there was a lot of controversy and I was very skeptical. But man oh man was I proven wrong. I mean wow, these trailers were just incredible. I mean one of the biggest things I, I, was, I was having an issue with and I was feeling like they wasn't going to get down packed was the art style from the anime. And when we see these trailers, I mean, the art style is just incredible. It's beautiful. I mean, it has this Asian slash futuristic type of feel to it. I mean, it's just beautiful. I was just stunned. Even though we only got about five to ten seconds of the trailer, I mean, this was just incredible. I was just blown away. Not just that, these trailers had uh, this kind of dark slash scary futuristic theme to it slash kind of like a, a little mature theme to it and I really like that. I really like that dark mature theme. That's really really awesome. So now we have a we get a, a, a small picture of Motoko Kusanagi. It seems like she's waking up or she's getting up and you have this this window behind her and you can see like this this city or buildings or something and I'm like wow that is just incredible. I was just this this blown away. But one of the scenes I really like a lot is the scene where you have this doll that's walking down the aisle and man this doll has this very scary feel to it like something bad is getting ready to happen and I'm like wow bravo that's just incredible this this doll or this this this, this cyborg is just walking down. I'm like, man, this is just incredible. Just look at the detail on her. It's just beautiful, just awesome. Now, there's a few things in the trailer, maybe like one or two things that kind of made me ask some questions. You have this one part where the major, she's touching this girl, and then we have, like we hear something like, what are you? Now, in the Ghost in the Shell anime, it's pretty much public knowledge that you're either human or android or human that has some um, enhancements. So I'm really kind of lost about, like, why was that question asked? I know the Major is not like any other android, but at the same time, it's not like she's an alien or anything of that nature. So I'm really lost on that area. Now, maybe this could be a new robot and she doesn't know the difference between humans or androids. That's a possibility. But... Overall, I was a little lost on that, and I can't wait to really get some more context in another trailer. Hopefully, we get a, a much longer trailer coming in. But the next thing I got to say is that I'm just really, really happy so far about what we have. Now, one of the cons that I will say is right now when I seen the only like maybe five or two seconds of Scarlett Johansson, I really wasn't like really impressed at the moment. I seen cosplay that was a little bit better than this. Her hair seems like kind of wiggish or like a wig at the moment. Now, even though we only get like two or, or, or three seconds of her on the um, screen, maybe it was just a really, really bad shot. That's a possibility. I can't wait till we get a longer trailer so we can see her in different angles. But I'm quite sure once the trailer, once the, the movie becomes more finalized, she's going to look badass. She's going to look really, really awesome. But right now, I got to say, when I look at this trailer, I'm not feeling her right now. Someone asked, if you're going to put some stock in her playing a major, right now, I'm just not feeling it at the moment. But I'm I'm waiting to be proven wrong. I'm quite sure they're going to hook her up. I'm quite sure they're going to fix this. Now, once this movie come out, I mean, I just, I, I'm just, I, just, I just can't wait, man. I'm just so pumped. But that's the only bad thing I can say. The only negative thing I can say about this trailer. Overall, the trailer was awesome. The art style Everything I've seen so far was really, really good. But what did you feel about the trailer? Did you feel like it was awesome? Did you have some things that brought up some questions? Did you dislike the trailer? Let me know in the comment box below. But please rate, subscribe, and comment. It really helps the channel. Thanks for watching. Matane.